House of Dallas Top Ones cracking it. Steve Boss reacts to this video by Delia. It's titled, Asmund Go just destroyed his career. Is he a pedophile too? Every single week it's a new person. Every single week. Well, I'm just assuming. I don't know. Anyway, let's see what happens. Let's watch. So, Asmund Gold was just banned on Twitch for a week and 14 days. Should have been way longer for the hate speech that went on during his live stream. For those of you that don't know who I'm talking about, it honestly doesn't fucking matter. His views on Gaza is so horrible. We don't even mm, need to yeah. discuss his background or accolades. Fuck that. They don't matter. I'm sick of people using their platforms to spread hate. Like I'm the one to talk, but hey, I'm not spreading good. this kind of hate. <laughs> These people are not your allies. They are not the same as us. He looks... <laughs> <laughs> he literally looks like he would say some hateful, bigoted shit. Like, I'm not surprised at all. Like, this literally doesn't surprise me. He Thank also you. looks like he could be a PDF out, too. I'm not putting that on nobody, but I'm saying I definitely wouldn't be su surprised, <laughs> be surprised about that either. He just got that look. You know, some people just got that look. I'm from an inferior culture that is Ooh. horrible. It killed people for their identity, and it is directly antithetical to everything Western values stand for, and it is an inferior culture in all ways. Shut up, shut up, bro, shut up, bro. I'll never discriminate against another country or put a religion down. It's weird. Typical behavior from a yeah. guy who looks like his auntie is his mother and his uncle is his father. Yeah. I'm not surprised at all. The internet is caving in on Asmongold, so I figured I should bully this guy too. Why if you want to consider a genocide as a systematic killing of a group of people, they have genocide built into Sharia law right now. So no, I'm not going to cry a fucking river when people who have genocide that's baked into their laws oh, are getting baby. genocide. What he said was disgusting, just yeah, like his life. Yeah. His life is disgusting. He, he lives like a slob. Look at these Ew. pictures. His house looks like it smells worse than No, before. no, no. This is not his real. Oh my God. This is so sick and disgusting. I know he got roaches in my. Oh my God. Who lives like this? a porter potty in the middle of july and he has the audacity to say the people of gaza are inferior they are not the same as us they come from an inferior culture how can you say the people of gaza are inferior and we could literally smell you through the screen this you need to worry his... about cleaning your house bro look at him he right there he got oh god get him off of me. <gasps> oh, no, bro. i i said it i said he got roaches I said he got roaches. <laughs> Not what are you doing, bro? Like that's a pet. Like you just got a roach pet. Ew, ew. No one should ever have roaches that damn comfortable or even at all. Why Crawling is it so on big? Your stream like that, that roach did not fear you. He climbed on top of you quick as if it was a clip from OnlyFans. This man is a multi millionaire and he lives like this. He subjects himself to every single day with fast food so old he can't remember when it's from and a desk. And is floor completely covered in yeah, microplastics. Exactly. I don't even remember when I had that. Um, here's my desk. There you go. My character, fucking awesome. This is straight. This is not an old picture. I'm telling you right now, this is not an old picture, guys. Who knows how often he wipes his ass? I am a if he even does. He probably bathes four times a year, and he has the audacity to think he's Talk superior. about an inferior. Fuck out of here. <laughs> and his room probably is worse today, or maybe slightly better. I don't know. For him to add more empty fast food cups, you know, to the table, he probably cleaned it up a little bit just to add more junk and trash. It's sick as hell to justify the annihilation of religious people, but I mean, he looks like the type. This pretty privileged douchebag sits behind his computer, safe with his roaches, with his yes, Frito yes, hands yes. smelling like stale chips and hot mayonnaise, Ew. sticking his nose up to innocent people getting unalive, justifying the kids and the babies being sacrificed, and all he could say is he doesn't feel sorry or bad for them. No, I don't feel bad for them. I don't feel sorry for them. I don't care. 
I don't support them. We would trade you in a heartbeat, That's Asmund Gold. I don't even know if I'm saying your name right. Now I really don't care. Fuck it. I'm not going to cry a fucking river when people who have genocide that's baked into their laws are getting genocide. And how much did they kill? You, I like as that many as they can. They're not able to kill as many people as Israel because they don't have as many bombs and as many weapons. But if they did, they'd be doing the same thing. That's it. Just takes enough. That's right. Don't listen to this caveman. Annihilation of a group is not baked into their laws no more than it is baked into the very laws of our country that do it to people of color. What the fuck is the difference? I don't give a fuck. They're terrible people. It's what? not even a question. It's crazy that people don't see it that way. So innocent children and kids They're are terrible, terrible people. people. That sounds familiar. They once said the same things about my people when using us as alligator bait. He, and he listen. Probably, he probably said the same thing about black people. I would be very surprised if he's not racist. Like, again... I'm not trying to compare it to the people of Gaza, and I'm not trying to take away their pain or their oppression. I'm comparing this piece of shit to the people he's justifying destroying Gaza. And this country was no different. I hate to be that guy, but with his analogy on Gaza, we should also say the same shit about our own country, considering the 400 years of mass destruction towards black Americans. How dare you talk about an entire culture and group them together and say, good, I'm glad they're being removed how inhumane is that psychopathic type of mentality it's alarming that this guy thinks it was a good idea to make such a statement while sitting right. in his film drinking his chick-fil-a drink they'd be doing the same thing mm. His inside what the fuck is wrong with you? Y'all really ahead. just make anybody rich and famous these days. How does anyone enjoy watching someone soak in their own filth like Asmongold? What's fun about watching it? I feel like his audience, they probably live like this too, so they find him relatable. How he's living is how I picture trolls to live. <laughs> Whenever I see a troll comment anywhere, okay, I always just assume that that's just how they live and they're just so miserable and they're just, you know, in their own filth and just misery and they are just on the internet because they don't have any other outlet. They got no friends. You know, so that's just, that's how I view trolls. So it's so wild to see that it goes beyond just trolls that you have people who are well off financially, I'm assuming. Um, because I don't know what he do with his money. Maybe he gambling it all up. <laughs> He's actually broke. I don't fucking know this man. But I I just can't understand how any human would want to live this way. It, it this boggles my mind. Doing this dirty on stream anyways. I guess waiting to see another roach moment, huh? I believe he's a gamer and a reactor. I just can't believe he was able to get a fan base. But I mean, hey, it's not something meant for me to understand, I guess. So then, of course, once Twitch took his bag away and banned him for that punk ass That's 14 days, he goes on Twitter and he apologizes. Course, Looking back on it, I was way too much of an Looking asshole about the Palestine thing. No, that's how you My feel, bad. brother. Of course, no one deserves to have their life life destroyed That's even if said. they do things or have views i find regressive oh, you guys deserve more than me saying stupid shit like that I'll do better. Man, that's Look called damage control. This shit wasn't genuine. He very much And he even sprinkled in there uh, some doubling down a little bit. <laughs> it's on what he said. So it's like, that's how you scenes. feel. When are we going to stop giving people like this a voice and a platform? And when are social media platforms going to hold people like this accountable? That two-week ban ain't shit. You, he needs a longer ban than 14 days. After saying some ignorant shit like that, that's hate speech and that's not cool. I mean, but what do I know? This is just despicable. And the fact that he felt so comfortable to get on his platform and say that with his whole chest is crazy. These people are getting way too comfortable. I feel like they get so much fame and power and money that they just become very reckless. But you already revealed your hand. You told us how you feel. You exposed yourself to be a disgusting bigot. And I'm also very disturbed with the way that he lives. I didn't need to see those images. Oh my God, that was very disturbing as well. And the fact that Twitch only banned him for two weeks says a lot, it's crazy. That's that's all he gets and then he's able to get back on your platform.
and given the opportunity to be more hate. That's crazy. Anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think. Let me know in the videos you've been watching. I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.